Hey everybody, it's Marshall Fryman here for TradeInDetectives.com. Today I'm unboxing the limited edition of Destiny for the PlayStation 3. It's the last version available at my local GameStop. Um, it's just after midnight here on the west coast of the U.S. I hope your launch went well. Um, did you go to the midnight launch? Did you attend uh, any events? Let us know in the comments below. Let us know how that went for you. Here we have the outside slip cover for the game. Um, just like any traditional game cover, it has a recognizable front cover uh, for display on shelves and then a list of included contents on the back. Things like uh, ER, or ESRB or your regional governing board ratings, uh, safety warnings, compatible features for your console. Inside the slipcover, you have the what I would call the true box for the limited edition. It's a nice, tasteful, simple black box with these uh, kind of silver inlay astral patterns. I think they're loose approximates of a star chart. There's not enough to really see. When you open the box up you have a your steelbook case the folio and this writing we are surrounded by darkness we always have been perhaps that is why the traveler chose us for even death cannot extinguish our light steelbook case uh, it's, it's decent quality it's uh it's a little bit light for my liking it doesn't seem incredibly sturdy it seems like a lot of the structural support comes from the plastic inside the metal, but it does look very nice. Here we have what the box claims to be a limited edition disc, as well as the game's included contents, or not the game's included contents, I'm sorry for that speaking there, for the limited edition content as well as the expansion pass that's included in both the limited edition, the guardian edition, and the uh, ghost edition, as well as the generic safety information included in every video game. You can't see those codes. I'm sorry, those are my codes. I'm going to eat them up. Um, num, num, num. Next we have the Guardian's Folio. It's a nice leather-bound book, or at least it's advertised as a leather-bound book. I think it's a high-construction paper made to have a weathered appearance. Still, though, it seems very high-quality, very durable, very sturdy. It has these nice rivets, uh, these little flourishes that make it uh, appear to be leather-bound. Inside you have your arms and armament guide. As well as that nice little symbol on the left. I don't know what that is. Might come up later. Might just be symbols. The Arms and Armament Guide includes uh, some concept art, some uh, detailed explanations about some of the weapon types in the game and specific weapons. It also includes some special codes to use on Bungie.net to unlock content, not just exclusive to limited edition purchasers. Um, these codes are permanently redeemable so far. People have been redeeming them since before the game launched. Here you can see different concept art and pictures of weapons in the game. Small explanations, some notes, some scribbles. There are a couple drawings towards the center there. Oops. Doesn't that look nice? Coming up next, we have the Guardian's letter. Um, from what I understand, I didn't take the chance to read this while uh, doing the unboxing video. I'll probably read it for a more in-depth look at all the content included at a later point. 
but like the armament armament guide it has a uh it has some codes to be redeemed on bungie.net put up a list of all the codes included in the limited editions it, uh, at a later point next up we have the postcards included in the limited editions I made some from some uh, pretty high quality cardboard I'm pretty impressed with the postcards they're probably my favorite part of the limited edition very they're very pretty they look nice they have a uh, kind of kind of art deco-y style to them kind of techno deco i guess you would call i might call it maybe not you i would um the postcards are for the four visitable locations in the game earth russia the moon mars and venus as you can see there you have venus you can send these to your friends but why would you i'd rather keep them myself Finally coming up, we have the star chart included in the limited edition. Um, you know, it's the poster. It's your typical limited edition poster. But it's made from some high quality materials. It seems pretty durable. At least more durable than posters I've received before. Um, I, it's, it seems like a plastic material. Very nice. Very low key style to it. I'm not sure what the specific art style you would call it is. Um, but it's kind of from that, uh, kind of from that period of exploration. Now here I'm going to line up just to, uh, get a nice good shot of everything included in the limited edition. Just for you to see. Um, quite a lot for, you know, I mean, it's a lot for a box that size, I'd say so. Thanks for watching. Uh, tune into TradeInDetectives.com for your video game news and trade-in prices.